Hi, sixth graders. It's hard to believe that we're at this time of the year where it's time to say goodbye and watch you fly off to Kasner to, to do amazing things. And I just want to let you know what a special group of kids you are to me. You know, you were the, the first group I had as kindergartners that went all the way through to sixth grade. And that makes you a pretty special crew, even those of you who came along in different grades. It's just been um, great to get to know you as um, individuals and collectively as a group. You've just done amazing things. You know, Mrs. Bowles always talks about leaving a legacy. And I think that when you can look back at your elementary years, you definitely did leave your legacy here. You know, we did amazing things together. You know, from a national blue ribbon ribbon school to district wrestling championships, we we've done so many things together. And um, I hope that you will take these experiences as a great foundation and just continue to follow your path. Each of us has a special path that we're on. Never let anybody take you off your path. Surround yourself with the kinds of friends who are going to push you to do good things for yourself. Um, no friend should ever make us want to do things that will take us off of our path. So find connections at Kasner. It's so important to be involved in something, even if it's just a club that you get involved with. Get to know people and um, really find a place where, where you feel that connection because that's going to keep you focused on the important thing and that's your learning. And before you know it, we will be watching you walk across that that stage getting your diploma, graduating from Clovis West, and it's gonna be such an honor to watch you do that. You will always be a part of our Pinedale family. I don't just say that, I really mean it. If you need anything, you know where to find us. Any one of us would be happy to help you with anything that comes to knock you down sometimes. Remember, when you get knocked down, you get right back up in the game of life. Um, you have people here who will always believe in you, who will always be rooting you on, and great things happen to kids that come from Pinedale Elementary School. You better believe that. So don't forget that Pinedale pride, and I can't wait to hear about all of your successes as you head off to junior high. I know this year isn't what we had hoped it would be, but I can tell you that you are gonna be the most resilient um, students we've ever had the privilege of working with because you know how to face challenges and work through those challenges. So um, once again, we love you, we'll miss you, and you'll be in our heart forever. Have a great time at Kasner. Congratulations to the sixth grade class of 2020. I am extremely proud of you and all of your accomplishments here at Pinedale. It's hard to believe that just a few years ago, some of you were sitting in this classroom as my very first class of second graders. Others have been athletes on my team, and others simply walked into this classroom because you knew you were always welcome. Please remember that it will always be this way. Once an eagle, always an eagle. Congratulations, love you all. Hi, sixth graders. I just wanted you to uh, get a quick message to you that I am so sorry that the year ended so differently than normal and you didn't get to experience some of the things that I know you love and look forward to. I really hope that your time at Kasner and Clovis West is everything that you want it to be. Have a great summer. Uh, do all the fun things that you can and um, please remember that we would really love to see you back at Pinedale because once an eagle, always an eagle. And we all love you and care about you and want you to be successful from uh, here on out. So good luck with everything and please come back and see me. Talk to you soon. Bye.
Congratulations, sixth graders. You did it. Onward and upward now. Always remember, you'll be a Pinedale Eagle. Places in the heart, you'll always have a home with us. Thank you guys for very much for making my first year at Pinedale the most memorable one because I love it here now. I'm here to stay. Remember Room 9's chant. I am responsible for my actions every day of your life. I am somebody, I will be somebody. Yes, you will, because we all believe in you. Each day you enter a classroom, you will be ready to learn. Each day you leave the classroom, you will have more knowledge than the day before. Always remember that, it's a true statement. Therefore, give it all you got. We know you will, super proud, onward and upward. Mr. Rivera loves you guys. Go Pinedale. Hi, sixth graders, Mrs. Taffy here. I know the end of the school year is not how you had envisioned it, but that does not mean it's not special. Just things look a little different than they did a few months ago, but as Eagles, we are tough and we can persevere through tough times. Um, I have no doubt that you're gonna go to Kavner and show all those students what it means to be hardworking and kind and an overall dedicated student. I feel so honored that I got to be some of your teachers and got to coach some of you. I really hope you come back and visit and share all your accomplishments with me because you are always welcomed at Pinedale and I love hearing about your lives after Pinedale Elementary School. I'm just so proud of you and be proud of yourself. Don't be afraid to try new things at Kasner. Don't be afraid to fail. Just overcome the obstacles that you face, roll with the punches and do your very best and you will be successful. Congratulations, Mrs. Pappy is so proud of you and have a great summer. You deserve it. Hi, sixth graders. Just wanted to tell you how proud I am of you. Always remember Pinedale Pride. We will always be your Pinedale family. Way to rock it. Sixth graders, you made it. It was a very interesting way to finish the year to say the least, but I'm super proud of you guys. Uh, all of you have done an amazing job um, just you know, adapting to this uh, distance learning and everything, but you guys are gonna do amazing things at Kasner next year. I know it. Um, to the ones that I saw on a regular basis and talked to every day, I will miss you guys. Uh, don't hesitate to come and say hey to me on campus next school year. And um, I'm really gonna miss you guys and I, I really hope that everything that Mr. Cox and Mr. Morgan have instilled in you guys, that you take that to Kasner and just, you know, you guys are gonna do great things. You guys are just gonna exceed above uh, anything that you ever imagined. You just gotta put your head down and do the work, you know, and you guys are gonna do amazing and awesome. I believe in you guys. Uh, I know you guys are are maybe a little nervous about going into into seventh grade next year, but uh, you got this. You know you have our support. You know we believe in in y'all. And don't forget that the choices you make every day uh, have an outcome on the person that you want to be. So here's to uh, the end of the school year and. Uh, Hope you guys have a great year next year. See ya!
Hi sixth grade, it's Mrs. Ribble here. I just wanted to say congratulations. You guys are moving to seventh grade. I will miss you all so much. My friends who are in cheer and history day and friends I just got to know. Um, I wish you guys the best. If you need anything at all, please let me know and come visit. Bye, have a great summer. Hey, sixth grade family, it's been a while. Distance learning was crazy, but we made it through. I'm super proud of all of you. And honestly, through all this, looking back, I'm just really, really proud of how, not just sixth grade, but my class worked together, built relationships, worked really hard. And I know that as you guys move forward, you guys will all be successful. I have no doubt about that. Um, one thing too uh, that I just wanted to remind everyone of is that although we, we teach day in, day out, you guys learn plenty, but the one thing that I know that I'll hold on to the most is the laughs that we had. Uh, and when you guys come back around, I know that's what we're gonna be talking about. Uh, those days that we were rolling on the floor laughing uh, will be the topic of conversation for sure. Um, and that's what I look forward to. Um, as you guys move on and come back, um, just those, those memories will be uh, cherished forever. And uh, I know you guys will do great, so um, I do wish you the best, and we'll see you soon. See that heart back there? Right there. You guys are the heart of Pinedale sixth grade. You guys are the ones that we're thinking about the most right now that you're gonna move on and we will miss you greatly, but we know you're gonna do great things. We're excited for your future. What a wild year this has been. When we started this year, I could not imagine that this is how it would end. So on your way out, we wish you the best. Thank you so much for staying connected to us and letting us into your lives during this time when it would have been real easy just to go home and not do anything, frankly. And you guys didn't do that. You went home and you worked and you kept with us and you let us connect with you. And that's what it's gonna to take to be successful at the next level is you find an adult and you connect with them. So I challenge you to go into seventh grade, make connections, show people your heart and let them know who you are. If you do that, you will shine. Don't hide from who you are. Be who you are meant to be and be amazing. Make a difference, kids. We hope to see you soon. Have a great summer and come back and say hi to us. Mr. Morgan out.